an end today as we return to racing for the opening event of what promises to be an enthralling season. Welcome along then to round one of this year's Formula One World Championship. We go racing today around the 3.36 miles of the magnificent Bahrain International Circuit with 15 corners and two good passing opportunities into turns one and four. Keep an eye out for drivers locking the front left tyre into the tricky braking zone of turn 10. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Charles Leclerc lines up on pole position. Edging out Lando Norris, he'll start from P2. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Verstappen, Hamilton, Sainz, Russell, Fernando Alonso, Stroll, Albon, Ocon, Bottas, Gasly, Oscar Piastri, Ricardo, Joe, Magnussen, Sargent, Holkenberg, Sonoda, and with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. A new season then, a clean slate where anything could happen. Anthony Davidson is with me today, as once again, we get another year of Formula One underway. We're into those tense few minutes before the first race then. Everyone's a little bit nervous about reliability. They haven't been running in the hot, turbulent wake of other cars in practice. And they've not been pushing at 100% for long durations. Let's hope no one has to deal with any nasty surprises. OK, back...
DRS is being enabled this lap. We can use DRS when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. Teammate behind is 6.4 seconds.
Oh, superb driving. That is the race win, my friend. Well done. That's a fantastic team effort then to secure victory here in the desert. And talk to me. What do you think it was that sealed the win for them? Well, when you overtake that many people, I'd certainly hope you'd win the race. Their car was really effective in the slipstream here today, and the team would be pleased that they didn't cook the engine, given how long they were spending in the hot air behind other cars. They had a lot of confidence to push their tyres hard as well, especially going into the corners, which allowed for some late braking and some exciting passes. Red Bull put up an outstanding fight for the front position today, and it's great to see it paid off for them. They do so much for the sport that you can't help but be delighted by today's race win. So let's review the driver's standings. After today's impressive result, we have a new points leader. So, Anthony Davidson, who would you rank as your driver of the day? Let's move on to the constructors and Red Bull take over as championship leaders. Well, that was certainly an exciting weekend of Formula One. Be sure to join us for more exciting Formula One action very soon.